Saving water supplies in drier parts of the nation is the goal of a U.S. Department of Agriculture effort. The USDA Natural Resources Conservation Service grant is funding a three-year demonstration project administered by the North Plains Groundwater Conservation District and Texas Tech University to show how strategic irrigation and crop system management can save water and help farmers. This is, I think, good use of, of money uh, instead of just direct payments to uh, a farmer. We can show that we're using these resources, money resources, to help us, especially in this area with our farming practices. The almost $500,000 in grant money will go to farmers, researchers, foundations, and other groups trying out water saving practices. The Conservation Innovation Grant is an opportunity for these entities to receive some federal financial assistance to help them uh, go through the process of testing out their theories, their ideas on the land and uh, then hopefully they'll pan out and NRCS will be able to take that technology and implement it on the ground. Some of these water saving theories are being tried in an area that pulls much of its irrigation from the Ogallala Aquifer, a vast underground water source that stretches from South Dakota deep into the Texas High Plains. The overall goal would be if we can grow 200 bushel of corn on 12 inches of added irrigation, we think we can save approximately four to six inches of water application for that crop on over a million acres of irrigated land, that's huge. That's water that's left in the aquifer for future generations, for my kids and my grandkids, and we extend the life of the aquifer. The grant is one of 52 awarded across the nation this year by USDA and RCS. For the U.S. Department of Agriculture, I'm Bob Ellison.